Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can backup your Mac operating system files and application data using an inbuilt uh, app, which is called Time Machine. So Time Machine allows you to back up your Mac operating system data into a external hard disk. So what you need to have is you need to have an empty hard disk in order to use Time Machine. So what I have here with me is my WD Passport uh, hard disk, which is uh, empty. So if you have any uh, data on your hard disk, it will be lost. So make sure you don't have any data on your hard disk. And once you plug your hard disk into uh, your Mac operating system, you will be able to see your hard disk on your Mac desktop. I can see my hard disk here, which is my passport. And when I open it, as you can see, uh, it doesn't have any data inside it. So to use a uh, time machine to back your data into this hard disk, what you can do is you can just click on this Apple icon here and then click on system preferences, which is going to open the system preferences window. And once this system preferences window opens, you will be able to see this time machine uh, icon here so I'm going to just click on this time machine icon so here in this time machine app you just need to select your hard disk in my case it's my passport so make sure you know the name of your hard disk and then click on select backup disk and you can see uh, my hard disk is visible here so I'm going to select this hard disk and then click on use disk which is going to uh, use this disk for the time machine backup. Now, as soon as you select it, you will uh, see this window which says, are you sure you want to erase the backup disk, my passport? So as I said, you should not have any data on your hard disk because if you have any data, it will be erased. So as you know, I don't have any data. So make sure you don't have any data on the hard disk. And once you are sure, then you can just click on erase, right? So just click on erase button, which is going to essentially format your hard disk and erase everything from your hard disk and which is going to unmount your hard disk from your Mac operating system and mount it again into your Mac operating system. So you can see the hard disk icon is uh, disappeared and reappeared once again. And now, when you see the my passport or your hard disk icon here, it will be uh, shown as the icon for the time machine. So as you can see, uh, the icon for the time machine is like this uh, watch and the same icon appears on your hard disk. You can do some more settings uh, using this options uh, button. So when you click on options button, as you can see, you can exclude some items from the backup. So if you have really big files, which you don't want to backup into your hard disk using Time Machine, you can uh, just use this plus button, which is going to uh, show you uh, this uh, finder view. And you can select the folders or files which you want to exclude from uh, the backup. You can select this option also, which says backup while on battery power. So your Mac operating system or Time Machine app will make sure that you are on the battery uh, power, then only it will create the backup. And once you are happy with all those uh, options, you can save them and you can see automatically it's going to start the backup and uh, it depends on the speed of your Mac operating system and your hard disk also how much time uh, it will take for the backup. And once this backup is complete, you can uh, use this hard disk as the backup for your Mac operating system. Also, you can see this option which says show time machine in menu bar. So when you check this checkbox, you will be able to see uh, this time machine option on your uh, menu bar. So from here, you will be able to uh, control your time machine backups. So you can see skip this backup because our backup is happening at the time of making this video. So if you want to skip this backup, you can click on this button. 
you can also enter the time machine and open the time machine preferences which is essentially this uh, window so when you click on this uh, option it's going to open this kind of uh, preferences window also you can see here what will be backed up so local snapshot as space permits hourly backups for the past 24 hours daily backups for past month and weekly backups for all previous months so it's going to uh, back up all those things and in addition the oldest backups are deleted when your disk becomes full so this is obvious the oldest will be deleted first if your disk uh, is full okay so as I said this is how you can create a backup on your hard disk using time machine app of your Mac operating system I hope you have enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next video.